Hey guys, your inner chakras. Welcome back to the channel, guys. If you are new, you are welcome. Guys, these summer colds or whatever you want to call it is the worst because it's bad enough. It's already hot. Then your body gets hot. Then you're hot, 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 right? It's too hot. Pandora's box, baby. Let's go inside. Let's go inside. Who's hiding what from who? What do you need to know? What don't you know? Don't forget, guys, to search these energies. Come on, spirit. What's going on? There's some personal issues, guys, that's going on that's deeper than the surface. So you're dealing with someone who really has something going on, and it's deeper than what you see. Like, it's uh, it's not surface level. It's all deep, and they're not sharing this with you. So something, something huge is going on with someone. Uh, you may think it's this, but it's something else. It's, it's deeper than what you see. It's deeper than you've been privy to or what they've shared with you. I'm not taking all of that. That's too much. I'm not even going to look at one. But you're dealing with somebody who has some personal issues that's deeper than the surface, right? This person, ooh, they got some issues and concerns. This person is pissed and quite resentful. So they could be angry at you and they want revenge. And they want revenge. What could you have done, right? So this person is pissed because their dreams have been deferred. So I don't know if you stepped in and deferred their dreams for whatever reason maybe they did something to you but they got some personal issues guys and it's deeper than the surface this person mm -mm. so they could be mad at you maybe you deferred the dreams maybe you ended something with them and they're just like they want payback or maybe you're dating someone they used to date and they want payback um Either way, whatever they wanted didn't work out the way that they wanted. Their dreams were deferred and they're pissed because of it. They're pissed. Holy Spirit, whose personal issues are these and what are the personal issues with Holy Grail? Negative energy, guys. Their energy is off. Return to sender. Negative energy, return to sender. See, that's why you don't know everything about this person. Their issues are deep. Their issues are deep. I'm going to take you with me on a deep dive. This is a lying narcissist. So they lie about everything. They lie any chance they get, right? A lying narcissist. That means they hype themselves up. They just lie. Okay, so you healed. You was probably dealing with the narcissist before, and they said you healed, and I don't like it. So the fact that you changed up on this person, you deferred their dreams. So now they could be sending you negative energy. They're trying to send you negative energy. They're trying to, uh, I don't know, take you where they are, right? They're, they're in a pissed off deal. They're feeling resentful. This person has some problems. So they are sending you negative energy, guys. Return to sender. Spirit, return that. Return it. Holy Spirit, they're lying narcissists, so they probably lied about any and everything. Everything that you possibly know about this person could have been a lie thus far. You are the woman holding the coin, I believe. Either that, no, I have a feeling this is you. You're the woman holding the coin. Maybe they're mad because of that. Yeah, and they're all tied up. They feel all tied up. So you could be someone who really has it going on, good job, good this, all of that. You went all the way, right? And they could be in a situation where they're tied up. Where they're tied up, and I think you're just not playing this game anymore with them. So, you you know, you backed out, you joined you, and now um, they don't like it. Yeah, you're the goddess of the moon. You kept going. You kept going. You was probably getting downloads from the moon or whatever, and the moon healed you. You're the goddess of the moon, so you heal, and they don't like it. And now they want to get you back because they're pissed. <clears throat> yep, this person just lied. They just lied. They probably lied about things that you don't even know about, considering that it's deeper than the surface, right? Holy Spirit. What is the, these personal... Guys, I'm so sorry about my voice. Y'all already know I be low. <laughs> How low can you go? It's going low today. Anyway, guys, uh, personal issues deeper than the surface spirit. What is this? 
surface. What's deeper than the surface? Something ended in their life with the sun card in reverse. They could have lost love, could have lost everything, right? Yeah, they lost it. They lost some happiness. Nine of Wands is in reverse as well. So this person has to take an L, take this loss. And they're very pissed about it. So they're sending you negative energy. Holy Spirit, clarify this negative energy. But you're returning that to sender. Ten of Pentacles. The negative energy is going to be about your money. Yep. <laughs> ten of Pentacles and a magician. Either that or could just be jealousy because you are the magician and you have your Ten of Pentacles. You have your abundance. You're this woman holding the coin. So whoever this person is, they lost an opportunity with you because they are a lying narcissist. And the fact that you keep gay and you heal, they don't like you. So you deferred their dream. You deferred their dream, right? Oh, wow. Holy Spirit, how pissed are they? Holy Spirit, clarify this pissed and resentful. How pissed are they, guys? Pissed enough to go to jail? <laughs> yeah, two of swords. They're pissed because you changed. Two of swords in reverse. And now they want revenge on you because you changed and you ended things with this lover. You deferred their dreams. You deferred their dreams. Oh, well. Well, guess what? It deferred your dreams, too, because you thought this person was something, right? And they turned out to be absolutely not. So guess what? You're pissed, too. It's just that you got things to do, so you're not going to stay in that space, right? They can stay in that space. They can live in pissed off bills if they want to. Holy Spirit, clarify these dreams of first. So they feel you have everything you need. You know, Ten of Pentacles, you're the magician. So you just constantly build and constantly manifest. And you have everything you need. This is a page of Pentacles in reverse. This person was sneaky. Very methodical, very sneaky. So whatever they did to you is the reason why you jumped ship. It is. It was unbalanced. They know it was unbalanced. But see, you heal, and you're, you're just not playing this game anymore. You're not playing this game anymore, chariot. See, you heal, they don't like it, and then you moved on. <clears throat> yep, yeah, you changed the game, and they wasn't ready for it. Didn't they know you was kin to Parker Brothers? <laughs> Your family wrote the game, right? Holy Spirit, clarify this woman holding this coin here. Yeah, you moved on. You're over it. You've been over it. You started following your intuition. You could have been tied up, caught up for a minute, but they're definitely caught up. But you have no regrets moving on. Once you got these downloads from the moon, you have no regrets walking away. None. You tried it, and now they're just pissed. They're pissed. They want to come and work with you. They want to have some type of teamwork with you, but they're not saying anything to you. They don't even know what to say because they're a liar. You're the queen of pentacles. I told you, you don't have no regrets. You don't have one regret. This person is a liar. And now they're sending you negative energy because you, you bust their bubble. You defer their dream. So now they're sending you negative energy. Spirit, tell us about this lying narcissist. Yeah. Spirit said you don't need to know too much. You just need to walk away. Six of swords. Spirit said you just need to walk away. You let me worry about this lying narcissist. You know enough that makes you leave, right? You know enough. Holy Spirit. Six of swords in reverse. Yep, it was unbalanced. They were giving other people. Here and here's the other people. Queen of Wands in reverse right here. Holy Spirit, Queen, introduce yourself right on, right on, introduce yourself right on. My name is Queen, yeah. And the Queen here was not their wish fulfillment, nor did they get any victory dipping off like that. So this person, person, whoever you are, you deferred your own dream. You deferred your own dream, and now you mad, and you kicking yourself. Because this person here, this woman holding this coin, the Ten of Pentacles, and the Magician, moved on. See, they healed from this trauma bond. That's what it was. It was a trauma bond. And you're still sitting in the trauma bond because you can't have a do-gooder and then have somebody on the wayside, too. Can't do that. Can't have both. 
Because the one that's more spiritually aligned or aligned with themselves, they're not going to fall for that. They just won't. They just won't. And I think a lot of people don't see that. A lot of people don't see that. A good person who has it going on, got they this, folks is this and that, trying to have it going on, just to have, like, you know where you're headed in life, you're not going to deal with this. People that deal with this type of stuff don't have shit going on. And if they do have shit going on, they really don't have any morals. Right? You see what I mean? They, they really don't have any morals. So, some people will fall for the okie doke and let anything happen, and then others won't. So, you need to distinguish between the two. Who's going to put in with your shit? And who's not going to put in with your shit? Right? And now you're kicking yourself because the one that's not putting up with your stuff, they crashed your shit. Crashed it. Stop playing this game. So next time when you go back out there, <laughs> the next time when you go back out there, do not be aligned to narcissists. That's pretty much the end of it. Stop lying. Stop building yourself up to be better than you are. Stop pretending that you're better than you are. Stop acting like you're so innocent. Stop this, stop that, stop this, stop that. I mean, when you start to lie like that, you have to remember your lies. And that's a problem. Because, see, that's where people slip up. Because trust me what I tell you, if somebody asks you a direct question, and they said, did you make this debt? And you're like, yeah, I made that debt. And you don't even know what debt it is, right? Yeah, I made that debt. So then, weeks later, they say, like, well, did you make this debt, this debt, or this debt? Right? And you're going to say, well, I made this one and this one. And the person that you're talking to, he's like, no, you said you made this one, right? And see how easy that is when you get caught up in a lie and you can't remember what you said? Well, guess what? The magician remember what you said. You got to keep up with your lies. You got to keep up with your lies. I don't know. Keep up with your lies and every now and then pull the book from the back of your pocket and be like, you know what? Okay, I did. Okay, yes, I didn't make that debt. Yes, oh, no. I did make that debt. The hell? Thanks for watching, guys. Please like, share, and subscribe.